Hello basketball fans, my name is Jamel Crothers. It's May and you know what time it is. Oh, you didn't know? It's the WNBA season. The WNBA season is about to start in a couple of weeks. Right now we're in preseason, so it's only fair that I do a season preview. So, let's get started with the Atlanta Dream. They're the new expansion team in the WNBA and they participated in a dispersal draft a couple of months ago where it consists of the team choosing a bunch of players that are not locked into the other franchises. So. They took a couple of players from a bunch of the WNBA teams, and this is what we have, a good team. And also, they participated in the WNBA draft, obviously, and they got some draft picks. So, to start off things, they did get some good size in Chantel Anderson, which is a good 6'6 center from the San Antonio Silver Stars. She's had some share of knacks and injuries along her way in her career with her knee, but she should be able to stay healthy and give them some good size down low this year. Also, Katie Feenstra, she's a 6'8 center. She's great with her size, she can block shots, she can shoot the ball, and she can do a lot of things with the basketball. Then we have Erica D'Souza. She's also a good forward from the Seattle Storm that the Atlanta Dream were able to pick up. She's very athletic and she's also from Brazil. And then we have Camille Little. She is also another good forward that is going to provide some good size from the San Antonio Silver Stars. She's now with the Atlanta Dream. Also, the backcourt. Let's get to the point guards. They have Ivory Lada. She's, a, she's, probably, she's looking like she's going to be the face of the Atlanta Dream. She's getting a lot of exposure. She's probably going to be the starting point guard also, and she's going to be able to give them some running gun offense, and she is a great little feisty point guard that can really play ball. They also have Kristen Haney. She uh, was a backup point guard for the Sacramento Monarchs. She was backing up Tisa Penichero for the past couple of years. Now she'll get the opportunity to get a lot more playing minutes playing with the Atlanta Dream and running their offense. Also, they also have Betty Lennox. She is the oldest player on the team. She's a great shooting guard. She's an eight-year pro. She's been been through the trenches. She's going to bring she's going to bring that uh, leadership to the Atlanta Dream, and hopefully, she will be able to provide a scoring spark also for the team. In the draft, they got Tamara Young from James Madison University. She's a combo. She's a guard, and she's also a forward. She's probably going to be playing a little shooting guard. She's probably going to be also playing a little small forward, and they may even throw at power forward also. She is a great lethal scorer, and she's going to bring a lot to the table for the team. Now, some concerns that I may have with the, with the Atlanta Dream. Well, their backcourt size. Benny Lennox is, is 5'8", and she's probably one of their tallest guards on the team. Now, as I was saying, Tamara Young might get some run at the shooting guard position to give them some size since the WNBA has a lot of tall guards in the league now. Their leadership. Their leadership is going to be a concern because the team is very young. They're going to have to get that team chemistry going, and that's going to be a concern for this team, even though they're new to the league. But obviously, a new team, it's going to take some time. It's just great that the Atlanta fans finally have a team there. And obviously, they're going to hit some bumps in the road because they're a new team. Obviously, as I said, they're good. there are a lot of new players that are trying to mesh together. There are some rookies. There are some veterans. Some, some players are used to certain roles. So obviously, the roles are going to change with this team. And there's going to be a lot of bumps on the road with a good with a good good team, but the team chemistry is going to have to get going. So that's my report on the Atlanta Dream. A great way to start the WNBA season, and congratulations to the Atlanta fans. You guys finally have a WNBA team.